Gino's Steakhouse, a Philly favorite. Gino's Steakhouse, a Philly favorite. This is Laurel. Thank you for tuning in to Laurel at Black Political Buzz Network. I am currently enjoying a Gino's cheesesteak. Yesterday, I visited Pat's King of Steaks uh, establishment, and today in Philly, I am a, trying for the first time a Gino's Philly cheesesteak. I, my steak sandwich has um, it's onions with provolone cheese. As you can see, the steak is like, I've given me a ton of steak here. I have the cherry peppers and my drink. So I'm going to bite into this sandwich, this Gino's famous Philly cheesesteak sandwich for the first time. Really good. Really, really good. One more bite. Mm. Delicious. Mm. So good. So which steak sandwich? between Geno's and Pat's is more advertising to me or the, the best tasting, I would have to say Geno's. Um, Geno's, I'm, I'm enjoying this Geno's steak, a uh, Philly cheese steak sandwich more so than I enjoy the one from Pat's. Even though Pat's, that sandwich was delicious as well. I'm enjoying the flavor, the meat at, uh, that I have on my sandwich from Geno's is more tender, it's more seasoned. The cheese is melted. It's like I like it. It's just delicious. Um, I have to give Gino's a, a thumbs up. Um, two thumbs up. I give Pat's a thumbs up. I give Gino's two thumbs up. So Gino's wins the taste test, in my opinion, between Pat's King of Steaks and Gino's in Philadelphia. So as I stated yesterday, if you're visiting Philadelphia, as a tourist, you cannot leave the city of Philadelphia until you have visited South Philly and uh, conducted a taste test between Gino's cheesesteaks and Pat's King of Steaks cheesesteaks and then you you come up with your own conclusion which one tastes the best all right I have chosen Gino's as my favorite so thank you for tuning in to Laurel at the Black Political Buzz Network I'm filming live from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Goodbye.